if you always forget your dreams or once in a while you find yourself not remembering your dreams, this can really be a big problem. So you need to find the solution to this as soon as possible. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. How are you all doing today? I hope you are doing fine. In case you are new here, my name is Pamela. So in this channel, I share spiritual tips and messages. Spiritual tips that will be a blessing to you, that will turn things around for you, that will teach you how to do your spiritual work yourself, teach you the right prayer to pray for fast answer. You doing it rightly, follow the instructions. By the grace of God, things will be working powerfully for you. If you love spiritual tips, go on and subscribe. Turn on the bell so that whenever I upload videos, you get notified and come and watch. Just like the title says, dream. Dream is one thing that you should remember because it's a message to everyone. It's a way of passing message to everyone, whether it's a bad dream or good dream. Like I've always said, it's very important for you to remember your dream so that you know how to solve one or two things. Even if it's a good dream, you have to also try to remember it so that you pray towards it. One thing is to remember dream and another thing is to make it happen, to make it manifest. So if you find yourself not remembering your dream, you should try seriously. Like if, it's, if it takes for you to increase your spiritual life, do it so that you can remember. There are some people that don't remember their dreams at all. Like that one is double problem. You never have problem in Jesus name. Always pray for you to dream and also to remember your dreams so that you know things that God is showing you. I've listed five things that you have to do before you go to bed. Five things to say before you go to bed so that you can start remembering your dream from today. This will also help those that don't dream at all. If you do this before you go to bed, you dream and also remember your dreams. So I've always explained about rosemary. Rosemary is a leaf. I've always shown the dried rosemary leaf. It has the fresh one. If you don't have the fresh one, you can make it of the dry one. Rosemary, generally, like spiritually, makes one to remember things. Whether it's academically, spiritually, mentally, in any way, it's a way of remembering things. For example, if your child or someone is not doing well in school, and you find out that the reason is spiritual, you have to make it a rosemary leaf, you know, use it for cleansing to help that child. So if you are the person that's always forgetting things, you can also do it for yourself. I've shown many ways how to remember your dream. You can go through my videos or check on YouTube. Type Palmas TV, remembering your dream. So you can make use of the uh, rosemary one. All you have to do before you go to bed, just get a bowl of water, add some rosemary leaf, okay, dry one or fresh one. Just add it into it. Maybe you want to sleep from 8 o'clock, 9 uh, p.m. You have to soak it in the afternoon so that by that time the color must have missed and infuse into the water that water is what you have to use to have your bath before you go to bed but i'm going to tell you five things to say into that water so that as you sleep it will make you to remember your dreams first thing you have to do is to tell god to have mercy upon you that you're a sinner like i always say forgiveness is the first thing because you don't know how you are you don't know how you are before god so you have to ask god to have mercy upon you that you're a sinner to clear way for you so that this will work powerfully for you also tell God your mind that you want to remember your dreams. Then after that, you have to enter into this prayer. Five prayer points you have to say. Please do not use this water yet. Remember what I said. Soak this water maybe during the day or in the afternoon. So that by that time you want to sleep, you will use, you will use the water to have your bath. If you soak this water, add salt into it to make it very effective. Salt is very cleansing. Salt neutralizes evil. So add a pinch of salt, just a little, into that bowl of water. So both of them together. Say this prayer like this. Powers that make me to forget my dreams. I am not your candidate. Aspire, aspire, aspire in Jesus' name. Powers that always make me to forget my dreams. I am not your candidate. Aspire, aspire, aspire now in Jesus' name. If you are not a Christian, please just pray. Then the next one is, Oh God, arise and retrieve back my dream from the ends of my enemies. Oh God, arise and retrieve back my dreams from the hands of my enemies. You know, some people, some evil people hijack one's dream. After dreaming, they know that that dream is going to show you great things you have to do so that your, your, your roads will be open, so that good things will start coming your way. But they will hijack it. They will steal it from you so that as you wake up, 
everything will be gone from your memory. Just pray that prayer point like this. Oh God, arise and retrieve back my dream from the hands of my enemies. Then the third one is anything or anyone blocking my memory from remembering some of my dreams. Be frustrated and leave me alone. Anything or anyone blocking my memory from remembering some of my dreams. Be frustrated and leave me alone from today in Jesus' name. The fourth one is every dream eraser from my father's house and mother's house that deletes my good dreams from my memory die today. You no know, forces that attack one, forces that affect one in life, that affect one's destiny normally comes from father's house or mother's house. Foundation. Your foundation matters. So pray seriously that anybody from your father's house, from your mother's house, stealing your dream, making you not to remember your dream so that things will start working well for you. Die, die, die in the name of Jesus. The fifth one, I reject the spirit of forgetting my dreams in the name of Jesus. I reject the spirit of forgetting my dreams from today. I reject the spirit of forgetting my dreams today. I reject the spirit of forgetting my dreams today in jesus name after praying you have to mix the water put your hand into it mix it one more time you can strain out the leaf of the rosemary or not you can just have your back like that please make sure you use this water without any chemical chemical i mean without any soap see this is one of the reasons why i said do not use soap during spiritual work like do not use all this synthetic soap when you are doing spiritual work except that soap is the one for spiritual work the best thing is just to use it to have your bath without any soap okay so that you will not mix things up okay so as you are using it to have your bath pouring on your body and be praying you don't need to repeat this prayer point again you have already said it you can just be saying normal prayer be praying and be using it to have your bath by the grace of god you have desires to be granted god will grant your request from today, you start remembering your dreams. Okay, this is something that has worked for me and is still working. So go on and try it, okay? Add it into your spiritual life and faith and by the grace of God, it will work for you. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe, share this video to everyone. Remain blessed as always. I will see you in my next video.